Hello, and welcome to this tutorial on creating stock items in Tally Prime. In this video, we will show you how to create stock items in Tally Prime so that you can manage your inventory efficiently. So, to create a new item in Tally, this is the home page of Tally. So, what we need to do is to come to create. Then we look for stock item. Then you enter. When you enter, it will bring you to this page. So all you have to do is fill in the details for your stock item. For example, if you are selling, uh, if you are selling uh, which item? Let me say chairs. Selling chairs. That is the name. And when you enter to party number, you can think of any name. Yeah, you can think of any name. Okay, like, uh, like, let me use. Ch. Then, if you have the category where it falls. I put it under furniture, you create for it the category. Yeah. Then uh, units of measure, chairs. Uh, now when you reach here to create a unit of measure, you just click Alt plus C. Then you can create your unit of measure. Let me use pieces. Let me use pieces or PCE. My name is Peace. The small places are just enter, enter, and save that one. <coughs> so I've successfully created the units of measure. Then here, set standard rate. You can enable this. Use a Y to enable. Then on this side of the selling price, you can put a selling price like 21,000. Piece. Yeah. So rate of duty, just enter. If you have the opening balance, you can put the quantity or the the cost price. When you enter, it saves in your system. Yeah. When it saves in your system, access it. You escape. Any alter stock item we've created chair so here it shows the part number and the name so this is what we've edited so if you want to make any changes here you can just make those changes like that the other thing uh, we can also enable I mean, to enable some of these features, you come to details. Yeah, so buying and selling standard rate, description, part number. So these are some of the these are some of the details of the stock item. You can put the name, part number, description. You can add notes. Can put it under stock group. You can put. Uh, we have created the unit of measure. If it has an alternate unit, you can also add alternate units. Yeah. Also the opening balance, costing method. Then now the standard buying and selling rates. Yeah. If you need more details, you just come to show more. And give you more details but for now those are the key parts after that you accept so when we go back yeah so that is the item we created So, to view the item, 
you come to here chart of accounts then you come to stock items then you can view the item we've created which is this this is the item we created chairs yeah so this is how it looks like And that's it. By following these simple steps, you can easily create stock items in Tally Prime and manage your inventory efficiently. Thank you for watching this tutorial on creating stock items in Tally Prime. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more tutorials like this.